Hello all and welcome back to another wonderful video. Today we got something very exciting, very, very, very exciting here in Ponytown because we got an update that um, I, I kind of have, have been wanting for a while. I just really kind of didn't really know how to say uh, my request. I didn't know how to ask for it, so to speak. But today we got a really exciting update. Uh, we got these carpets, uh, obviously, that I'm standing on right now. And we got that in every single color. Uh, but we're going to talk about that last because that is like the big grandiose thing here. The big grand finale, so to speak. Uh, uh, but for now, I kind of want to talk about how um, apparently they have improved the colors on the beds and carpets. I don't know exactly how much Im this has improved, how much this has changed, but they kind of look exactly the same. But the change log says that they did change the not change them but it says it's improved i don't know what that means exactly but apparently these colors are slightly different than what they used to be maybe i just can't see colors very well and maybe this is extremely obvious but uh regardless i thought i would go ahead and mention it because uh some of you may notice that they're slightly different in some way uh so and it is in the change log and this is this is an update video we, where we talk about the updates that happened in ponytown uh this this update by the way is version 0 0.67.0 so we got the 0 0.67 update here um and like I said, it's very exciting. Um, something else that they changed, which also um, it just makes me happy overall. They changed the, uh, the, the the little the little gifts right here. They changed these gifts. They changed it to where now you don't have to s circle through all of them to get the color you want. Now you can just press space or use the uh, paintbrush tool to get the color that you want. Uh, this I, I love this. Uh, makes it easier to to like just get the right gift that you want to get and then just place it. Uh, it also is a good sign for Pony Town because it's showing that they're, they're they're caring about the game overall. They're not just worried about one thing. They're not worried about like oh this this these are christmas presents so we don't need to worry about that until next december or anything like that that's not their thought process their thought process is hey how can we improve uh everything how can we improve everything uh to get the um the best version of ponytown possible and that seems to be their thought process and everything because uh you know these gifts this is something that i feel like a lot of other people would have just been like oh we'll worry about that when december comes or, or around winter or whatever like that because we can release it with like a christmas thing or whatever but no ponytown the developers over there are just like oh let's let's just update whatever we can change whatever we can to make the game just better and uh moving on to uh the other thing here uh they improved all item statues to allow cycling back and forth between them uh so if you don't know if you come up here to uh usually a gift pile because that's what they originally added it for but now it works now now it works for uh fruit boxes so Let's see, I accidentally go past the banana. Oh no, what happened to my banana? Give it back, I need my banana. So um, instead of going all the way back through and just clicking this a million times to try to try and get back to my banana, I can now hold down shift and press it once and I can go right back to the banana. So if you ever accidentally hit the uh, uh, fruit box nine times instead of eight times, you can pr hold down shift and press it one more time to get back to your banana. Um, but that's really kind of it for uh, that whole thing uh, with all these other small things. But I kind of want to talk about the big thing now because the big thing here is that now not only do we have a preview for the shovel to sh to for us to see what the tile is going to sort of look like I think this still needs a little bit of improving because um, let's see uh, for example uh, this is stone and that does not look like stone to me it doesn't look like it doesn't look like stone it doesn't look like this stone over here and the preview so that's something that I think can be improved um, just tiny things like that but I think it's definitely a great um, you know uh, start and everything like that um, but uh, as you just saw I was able to place a bunch of things all at once uh, and uh, that's that's the new feature that's the new feature that I I'm just completely floored about like I am so excited about this because now it's gonna make the building process just so much quicker now I can just make that whole thing green and then I can make this whole thing blue and then just go all the way all the way around like that and just get every single color that I want on there and I can you can just go through all of them and plus in addition to that we also have the carpets themselves which is just an excellent addition by itself for example if I want this little room to be black carpet I can do that uh, then I can make it a white carpet or uh, whatever else it's gonna make it a lot easier to create patterns if I want like an X through this or like a cross or something through this then I can do that 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 is a lot easier to do now because you can just go through the whole thing and it just makes the the building process so much quicker so much easier and so much better but it doesn't end there it doesn't end 
there with the improvements to the shovel because now you can now sort of pick block uh, which uh, flooring and stuff like that that you want. So let's say I have this black one on here right now. You can see my little preview. I, if I want to, say, switch all the way to this ice, which the ice would be pretty far away. It's all the way back here. Look how far away that is. But instead of, you know, scrolling with the mouse wheel or whatever, I can hold down shift and uh, click on that ice. And now I have ice that I can place anywhere. So I could put ice up in here. This works for everything. So if I want this water block, I can do that for this. I call it water block. I don't know why I called it that. But um, I, the reason why I called it that is because it reminds me a lot of pick blocking uh, and how that works in like uh, Minecraft and stuff like that. Because Minecraft has the whole pick block mechanic. And that's kind of what this is. You can now sort of pick block tiles, which is an, just incredible. It's just it's something that we I wanted for a really, really long time. But I never really knew how to ask for it because I didn't know exactly how to explain but anyway, um, that's going to pretty much do it for the video. Uh, the, the last update uh, that we got kind of gave us new tiles. It gave us this uh, this little tile right here, this little light tile, and then this dark tile. I never really mentioned those in a video because uh, these are impressive and these are good and all, but it wasn't really that big of an update. Uh, it was literally basically just this, and then they add, like um, fixed a couple of other issues and stuff like that. By the way, they did fix some issues. Apparently, one of these issues were um, players getting cloned in some cases, so I'm very disappointed that that never happened to me so I could record it and uh, maybe make a video on that but uh, I digress at least they fixed that because uh, that's that's good th th there's lots of fixes with this and all these other things like that so uh, yeah uh, anyway that's gonna do it for the video so um, I hope you learned a thing or two I hope you enjoyed and if you did please like subscribe share do those wonderful things because when you do those wonderful things you get access to wonderful content such as this that's not all you get that's not all you get you also get to become wonderful yourself and I think we all want that so do those wonderful things and until next time stay wonderful Wonderful.